On the health alert tonight, new government numbers show more and more children are being diagnosed with autism. So what does that mean for parents and researchers? CBS's Janet Choi has the story tonight from New York. We can do anything. Damien Mendez didn't speak until he was seven years old. It's just been really hard as a parent. 12-year-old Damien was diagnosed with autism when he was two. Now, a new report shows the development disorder is more common than first thought. It seems that more people are telling me my child has autism. The Centers for Disease Control say among eight-year-olds, one in every 110 is classified as having an autism spectrum disorder. Overall, we found in 10 sites across the United States that we saw a 57 percent increase. The numbers also confirm earlier studies that show boys are four and a half times more likely than girls to have it. The new numbers don't necessarily mean that autism is on the rise. A number of factors could be contributing to the increase. We identified more children because we had more evaluations, we had better descriptions. At the same time, a true increase in risk can't be ruled out. The Mendez family says no matter what the reason for the increase, more needs to be done. It's very scary to me because, like, like you mentioned, we don't have a cause, but it seems like our numbers are getting higher and no one seems to care. Special relationships. With medicine and special therapies, Damien is improving. But advocates say treatment is only part of the puzzle that needs solving. In New York, Janet Choi, CBS 3 Eyewitness News.